Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Coders Arcade. In today's video, I will be talking about Robot Framework. So what is Robot Framework? Robot Framework is a generic open source automation framework. It can be used for test automation and robotic process automation which is also known as RPA. Robot Framework is actively supported with many industry leading companies using it in their software development. Robot Framework is open and extensible and can be integrated with virtually any other tool to create powerful and flexible automation solutions. Being open source also means that Robot Framework is free to use without any licensing costs. And Robot Framework has easy syntax utilizing human readable keywords. Its capabilities can be extended by libraries implemented using Python or Java. The framework has a rich ecosystem around it, consisting of libraries and tools that are developed as separate projects. Robot Framework project is hosted on GitHub, where you can find further documentation, source code, and issue tracker. The downloads are hosted by PyPI. And the most important advantage of Robot Framework is that it is operating system and application independent. The core framework is implemented using Python and also runs on Jython or the Java virtual machine and Iron Python or .NET. Robot Framework itself is open source software released under Apache License 2.0 and most of the libraries and tools in the ecosystem are also open source. The framework was initially developed at Nokia Networks and was open sourced in 2008. Let me tell you something more about Robot Framework so that you can remember it better. So the Robot Framework was created as part of Pekka Clark's thesis in 2005. Then he went on to develop it at Nokia and finally he open sourced it under Apache license in 2008. And as I told you earlier, Robot Framework has many test libraries and other tools that you can use. The Selenium WebDriver library is probably the most used external test library. But Robot Framework can also test FTP, MongoDB, Android, Appium and many more. To those who are new to Robot Framework, I need to tell you that Robot Framework uses a keyword driven approach to make tests readable and easy to create. Robot Framework has a lot of APIs to help make it as extensible as possible. It's Python based, but you can also use Jython supported by Java or Iron Python supported by .NET. Now let me tell you about getting started with Robot Framework. If you want to know more about the documentation and theory of Robot Framework, you can go to the website www robotframework.org and you can read about the documentation source code and you can download the source codes which are hosted by PyPI. Now let us talk about the editor options. There are lots of editor options when creating robot tests. The best known is RIDE, R -I -D -E, which is a standalone robot framework editor designed solely for editing robot framework test data. There are plugins for PyCharm, Eclipse, IntelliJ and also for many popular programmer text editors like Notepad++, TextMeet, Sublime Text and so on. When you are starting with automation tests and you are creating automation test cases, the general suggestion which I want to give you is that you make sure that your tests are very easy to understand and this suggestion not only applies to robot framework but also to any other automation tool. The test cases you are creating should be always easy to understand. Now let us briefly talk about the key features of robot framework. The first key feature is that robot framework was created for testers by testers. That means it is very handy for testing engineers because of the APIs and libraries in it. The second key feature is its keyword driven approach. Its keyword driven approach makes test cases very readable. The last but not the least key feature of Robot Framework is that it is open source, which means it supports automating 
more than just simple web pages. You can automate many more with this. Now let us move on to the salary of engineers knowing robot framework. The average salary of an employee who knows robot framework is 20 lakhs Indian rupees or 27,600 US dollars approximately. And it mostly ranges from 10 lakhs to 41.5 lakhs Indian rupees or 13,800 to 56,600 United States dollars. And leading companies like Synecron, Alton Calsop Labs, Symantec, ACL Technologies, Stratus Technologies, Teradata, ASML, Genpact, and many more higher engineers who are proficient in robot framework. So as you can see, robot framework has a very high demand in the market. Therefore, you can easily get a job if you know robot framework. So this is about a brief introduction of robot framework guys. Hope you liked it. If you liked it, please share the video with your friends and family. Also subscribe to our channel and stay connected because we will be uploading more videos on how to work with robot framework and how to write test cases very soon. Thank you and happy learning.